Hi, my name is Mary Ann Chappell. I'm an artist, an arts educator, and the founder of a new not-for-profit in Sarasota, Florida called the Spaces Foundation. Spaces is a Sarasota project aligning artists, communities, exhibits, and studios. We are excited to be exhibiting with the SRQ Collaborative Artist Group. SRQ is a contemporary artist collective of accomplished Sarasota artists whose aim is to enhance the local visual art scene through the creation of unique art experiences and educational programming. We began discussing the SRQ Collaborative exhibition before the COVID-19 2020 worldwide pandemic hit. The show's intent is to work with artists outside of their membership to foster collaboration, community, and experimentation. As partnerships and ideas were being forged, the first cases of the coronavirus were being identified in the area. They decided to proceed, taking things one step at a time and staying flexible. Spaces has been doing some really wonderful things here. They have shows that show um, local artists as well as Florida-based artists. They have uh, affordable studios. They're really uniting the community together, which is very awesome. Really wonderful to have a space in which local artists can show pretty regularly. For me, it's been very exciting because it got me out of my comfort zone, which I think it has for a lot of the artists in SRQ. And I'm really excited for this opening to see what the community thinks about our collaboration. Each piece that you see here was made by two artists working together. Now, you have to remember this was made during the time of the pandemic, so it was really difficult for these artists to get together. Many of them had to end up doing collaborations via Zoom or the telephone. So we had to work through, are we going to work on the same piece? Or are we just going to talk to each other? <laughs> <laughs> or would we ship it back and forth? Yeah. Yeah. Or, yeah. And we both, I think, pretty quickly got to, we love to just collaborate on the ideas. So we agreed to make solitary, kind of make solitary pieces, but then continue to meet and talk about how they were going. So that's how the collaboration went. But tell them about the idea. Generally it has to do with the idea of um, the social structures that we have that so often fail us and how we go about grappling with the myriad of issues to which that applies. Annie for several years and we often talk about nature, our love for nature, and of course our love for art. This project gave us an opportunity to work with natural materials and um, kind of bring our two worlds together in a unique piece. The initial idea revolved around foraging and gathering items kind of like birds do when making nests. So it began as an idea of interweaving and getting items and objects that are important to us 
personally and as a society and uh, kind of bringing them together in one space, in one nesting unit. I think also bringing nature into the gallery kind of elevates it, kind of puts it on a pedestal. You know, this is art, this is worthy. Um, and at the same time, it kind of um, breaks down notions of gallery and art and archivalness. Truly, like our safe spaces and our nesting spaces now are like the inside world and then nature where we can be like away from people or um, those sorts of things. So I guess we're kind of bringing in those two ideas together. Our process is important. So I think the next like hour and a half to two hours for setup is going to be, there's going to be a lot of things coming together then as far as like our ideas and the piece itself. And so that'll be fun. And I'm really excited just to be here and have this opportunity. So thanks everyone. Collaboration implies an assumption of positive intent and outcome. It strengthens the idea that sometimes things work out better if we work on them together. The practice of sharing freely thoughts, ideas, and methods. The willingness to allow ourselves to be positively influenced by our friends, family, peers, and community. The ability to make space for others to be seen and heard. We hope that you enjoy exploring the many expressions of collaboration found in this exhibition and that you find inspiration to enhance collaboration in your own interactions.